the spot this morning. Probably hard to see me, but uh, we got birds gobbling for sure. A lot more than they did last night, which is awesome. So today is the warmest day of the week. So we're really hoping we can get the job done today. Um, but we're just gonna see what happens. We got a few birds to play with at least now. We know, you know, there's more birds here that are actually active. Like I said last night, they just weren't gobbling that much. We got one roosted right in front of me, actually. Yeah, it hasn't even gobbled yet. Um, but we got a couple more down the creek here. At least three. And then we have one um, off to my left, way down behind me. Which I think that one's for sure on our property. So we're just going to have to make a decision here on what we want to do. Um, but I'm fired up. Mike, Mike's fired up, too. I know you can't see him, but... Uh, This is what I live for right here, baby. I love it. But we're gonna get out there and uh, should be a fun day. I'm looking forward to it. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. I haven't spoken to me.
missing a tail feather. The one that's strutting is missing a tail feather. Don't move. <coughs> How far do you think that is? Alright guys, we're uh, back at the spot here, um, just kind of went and, I actually went to class and uh, went and got a bite to eat and everything. We're already here in some hens, we just kind of figured we'd let them rest a little bit. It's really nice out right now. There's a gobbler in his front yard like Yeah, I guess there was a tom over there, I didn't even see it. But, but he told us not shooting in his front yard, so. Yeah, probably shouldn't do that, especially if you want to keep hunting here. but. This morning went really well. Honestly, we got on a lot of birds. Had a couple close calls, I guess. I don't know if you guys can hear the hens going, but hopefully tonight we can get on something. Um, our last resort kind of is to go try to cut off like their travel to the roost, I guess. As long as they roost in the same spot, we should be in a good place. And uh, if not, we'll set up in the same place tomorrow morning and hopefully just get them on the fly down. So we'll get in there and see what happens. He's bird down. We're getting a film this morning. Well, we're gonna get the film, but bird down. As long as you're happy, man. I'm happy. I didn't know, cause you know, 
We wanted to get it on film, so I didn't know. We got a bird. Good job, dude. That's the first time we kind of done that. We've never, that's never worked. You jump shoot a. Bird. That's never worked. Well, I got a. First season in Iowa was done. First day. Um, didn't really go as we planned. We we wanted to be able to set up and get a bird on footage, but uh, these birds out here are still winter flocked up, and yeah. it's been tough trying to get them to work. They're all hand up. Um, I was gonna miss an opportunity. You know, you gotta take what life gives you, and it may not always be perfect, but that's why they give us. You know, we got two tags in Iowa, and we're blessed for that. So now we be a little more patient with the second tag. And we got a lot of good footage this morning, so it's kind of, if we wouldn't have got that footage this morning, I probably wouldn't have uh, just shot the bird the way I did, but done and over with now. Hey, you got it with your turn, your turning yeah, game, dude. This was a, so this is a, I got this when I was 11, back in 2012. Um, I got it a couple weeks early from Christmas. It was my Christmas present, so I could go deer hunting, and I shot my very first ever deer with this shotgun. I shot my first pheasant, my pretty much my first everything. I've ever killed it's been with this so I figured it's your first shotgun turkey. my first shotgun turkey ever uh, the only right to do it with this gun you know we have a really good property here with a lot of birds and we won't hunt here later in the season but I know a lot of people are gonna say well it's not the prettiest bird it's not the best beard but I really don't care it's it's an old bird I use kind of on the downhill it's kind of those things that we've, we've learned especially with turkey hunting is you know depending on where you're at in the time of year what season you're hunting is it can be rough out there and especially with turkey hunting becoming so popular in Iowa one of our other spots we hunt this year is public and you know if for some reason there would be a lot of hunters there I don't want to I don't want to get greedy you know you got to take what life gives you and the big guy upstairs gave me this beautiful bird today and he gave me the experience to chase them and you know we got to see a huge flock of birds get some amazing footage this morning um, we've worked a lot of birds you know I, I am 100% happy with this bird you know, I was blessed to also be able to shoot one out in Nebraska this year, so and that was that bird is probably a little bit more pretty, but you know what? It's it's the experience that counts. You know, we're gonna, never gonna forget this day that we came out and seen a hundred turkeys in a field and beautiful bird. And so. yeah, I just wasn't sure. I mean, it's funny because like we have had this situation what almost ten times I'd say, just walking ridges and we'd right, stumble you know, upon birds. And it's never panned out for us. You know, a lot of times before it's been with a bow so you can't just you know see ahead and take it off and right but you know i wanted to get, i really i really said shotgun hunting was still really fun so and it was cool to get out here and shoot with the 20 gauge and that is gonna wrap up first season in iowa another tag filled on the opener yes sir uh, but yeah we've been really lucky this year so that's uh as i always say where one journey start or one journey ends another one begins so now it's getting prepped for four season and keep on pushing. Yes, sir. All right, Mike. First shot or first turkey with that gun. Time to notch the stock, baby. Sweet. One down. Yes, sir. Well, that was a fun day. Had a great morning in the woods. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys enjoyed, uh, it's probably gonna be a longer one, but got some nice footage today. Had a, I had a fun day. I love getting out with people, helping people out. But not because I can say I you know, was with all these killed birds, but just because I enjoy it so much. It's um, fun working the birds. Especially just you know helping all my friends, just getting in, you know newer people into it, just like I was brought into it by people which you know who you are and I'm thankful for all those people but uh make sure you guys go hit that like button go subscribe I'm hoping you guys are having a good turkey season if you hunt if you're just watching the videos thanks for watching but uh I'll catch you guys in the next one peace